In this video, I'm going to show you how to insert page numbers starting with a certain page in Word and kind of how page numbering and headers and footers work. Um, as you can see, um, I'm going to turn on formatting so I can kind of see what's going on in the background. It helps a little bit. Um, you go to the home and then you click on this little icon and it shows like that's a return, it shows page breaks, things like that. One thing to keep in mind, in a book, this odd page, this page number one, this is going to be a right-hand page. So Word is actually displaying backwards to what would be displayed in a book. So if we want to insert, say, page number one on chapter one, starting right here, we would want to insert a section break before that. So right here we would go put our cursor there and click layout break and under section break we would click next page now sometimes that will add a page sometimes it won't don't ask me why in word it just does that um, if you if it does just remove the page break but keep the section break so we're going to go down here to chapter one we're going to double click on the footer area and that will pop up our footer screen. Now this is what gets everybody, the same as previous, same as previous, and uh, that will continue page numbering from this previous section, which is a good thing if you have a lot of sections and you're just numbering straight through. But if you wanna start the page at number one right here and say have Roman numerals here before that, then you have to take this link to previous off. Now notice how it removed the odd page, but it didn't remove the even. That is because I have different odd and even pages selected right here. That's not really not necessary for page numbering unless you want to put the page number on the outside on the right hand pages and inside on the on the other the even pages. So um, or if you want a different header at the top of each one so so for this one I'm gonna leave the different odd and even off so we can make it simple as possible so now that we've removed the link to previous and the different odd and even we can insert page numbers now so we'll click insert page number I'm gonna select bottom of page center which is the most common and click that now it's got an extra return in here, how you saw how it moved up, so I'm gonna remove that as well. Now, if, if for some reason that page number started with nine or whatever, and you wanted to format it differently, you'd click this page number over here under the Design tab, and you click Format Page Numbers, and then you could change this to start at one, 10, whatever you want or you can do continue from previous section, which we don't want to do. So right now it's displaying properly, so we're going to leave that alone. So if you want to go to this section now, the, the, the first section of the book, and just enter, say, Roman numerals, you do the same thing. You click the insert page number, bottom of page. We're going to remove this. And then we're going to do the format page numbers again. And we're going to select the number format and we're going to select Roman numerals. So that changed those to Roman numerals. And it kept these numbers the same as, as numbers. Now, some people want to say leave off a page number. On a chapter page, something similar to that, that gets a little bit more difficult because you're going to have to insert that section break both in front of that page and then after that page. So you will see section four, see how that says section four there. Like if you do that every chapter, you'll see section three, section four, section five. That gets really difficult at times. So. You know, you can try it if you want, but always you can always go back, hit the back button if any of the page numbers mess up. But that's the simple way to page number in Word. Thanks for watching.